what's the, the feeling like? Is, does this week feel a little bit different to normal? Yeah, I think um, doing the media here is one thing that's getting me in and um, there is a lot of anticipation for the weekend. Sunday feels like a long way away, but um, yeah, looking forward to it. Yeah, with your milestone game coming up, uh, I guess that, that was kind of what I was alluding to. Does it feel a little bit different because of that fact? Um, not so much yet. We uh, have had our review on Monday, but we haven't had training yet. So training's Wednesday, Friday this week. Um, so once we get around the girls and everyone's sort of yeah. looking forward to uh, getting into the game this weekend, it might feel a bit more surreal. Yeah. yeah. And uh, just with the review, uh, what do you think was the biggest takeaway from last game? Uh, it was great to get back to playing more our brand of football. Um, everyone sort of played their role again on the weekend and we played a bit more of a consistent four quarters and then, yeah, we really got more score on the scoreboard, which is what we're trying to do each week. Um, yeah. Looks like you had your most prolific match since round one, if I've looked at the stats correctly. Uh, I don't know how much you follow your own stats, but it looks like you had 14 touches, which was your most for the year. Um, since round one. Did you spend a bit more time in the midfield? Yeah, I had a bit of a slight change on the weekend, um, back into the midfield rather than out on the wing. Um, it was great to get in there and play a bit more contested footy, which is the footy that I love. So, yeah, hopefully, not sure what's the plan this weekend, but um, Collingwood are a great contested team, so regardless of yeah. where I'm playing, I think it'll be quite contested. Yeah, I don't think you've beaten them for a few years now, so that's obviously another big challenge too. Yeah, I think we beat them in round one on Geelong's first ever game um, by point, I think. And yeah, haven't been able to get on top of them since. Um, we did well against them in the practice match earlier this year, so hopefully we can continue that. Yeah, fantastic. And yeah, you know, it's a big milestone. And I guess the obvious question would be what's been the, the biggest uh, the biggest high point and what's been the biggest challenge you've overcome in your footy career? Um, I think just being a part of the journey from day dot with the Cats. Um, we've obviously had our lower moments and sort of riding that wave and now under Dan we're coming into some real club success so being a part of that as well just sort of the roller coaster, the ups and downs and yeah hopefully we can continue this season with um, going a bit better than how we ended last season. How do you think you are going compared to last year? Do you feel just comparing, yeah, this 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 period of the season compared to last? Do you feel that you're a bit more ahead of the game? Do you feel like um, you're just travelling that little bit better? Yeah, I feel like we definitely know what kind of football we want to play. Everyone's quite comfortable in their roles. Um, it's just the execution part over the consistency piece for four quarters, but... Um, I think we're in a great position. It's an exciting position. Um, obviously, the ladder's looking pretty tight across the board, but I think that's what makes the best football come out. Yeah, yeah. And just, just looking back over your career, do you have like a real standout mentor that's helped you? Um, no, not necessarily a certain person, I don't think. I think um, just being in the environment here at Geelong has been um, you know, great in itself. This week, a milestone game for you, but also many goals, 50th game in the Hoops. You're the first two players to reach a milestone for the club, and back in the day, both sides were the same as well. Is there a bit of extra significance for you reaching the milestone in the Turks? Yeah, for sure. I um, remember walking in signing with her, and I didn't really know her that day. So to have reached it together on the same weekend, I think it's really special, and um, she's an incredible leader. And yeah, I look up to her a lot, so it'll be great to run out with her on Sunday.